Ricky Martin is expected to appear in court in Puerto Rico Thursday after police served the singer earlier this month with a restraining order for alleged harassment. That's right. So Martin's 21-year-old nephew made the accusations, but Martin is now vehemently denying these harassment allegations, and he claims that he was never involved in a romantic relationship with his nephew. Let's get the facts from Regine Kassar. She joins us in New York. Uh, the allegations are obviously stunning. It's a complex law because it's a domestic abuse law, but these are not allegations of domestic abuse in the traditional sense, mm -hmm. they're harassment allegations. Mm -hmm. That's exactly Where right. Where do things stand? Well, this, this is what's interesting. I spoke with the police last night in San Juan, Puerto Rico, and they told me that this is an ex parte order. And so it's just like the United States. One party goes to court, and they allege, and they have their evidence, and they allege before a judge that they uh, want an order so someone stays away from them. And the police told me, it was granted, and the police told me that it is their knowledge that the allegation was that this nephew and, uh, and um, Martin were in a relationship. That relationship ended, and then two months after that, the nephew went to court to get that domestic order. Now, we also do know that the other side, Marty Singer, the attorney, is very strongly discounting any of this. I want to read to you. It says, Ricky Martin has, of course, never been and never would be involved in any kind of sexual or romantic relationship with his nephew. The idea is not only untrue, it is disgusting. And we hope that this man gets help he so urgently needs. But most of all, we look forward to this awful case being dismissed as soon as a judge gets to look at the facts. Now, we also know that Ricky Martin went to Twitter and he has said that this is completely false any allegation in this in this case. I appreciate the innumerable gestures of solidarity and I receive them with all my heart. Now there is a very reputable publication in Puerto Rico called El Vaquero and they are saying that there in fact was this relationship and that when it ended that Ricky Martin uh, allegedly kept going to the home of this nephew that he just couldn't get over what had ended. So that sort of goes along with what the police is saying. But next week there will be a hearing, mm -hmm. and at that hearing, both sides will be present and be able to give their side. And Ricky Martin, his attorney, should be there, but it could be virtual. They don't have to be okay. in person. Thank you, Jean, for the reporting, for the facts, for the hours you spent on the phone with the authorities. We appreciate it, as always.